Hey there, my name is Paul Kretz. I'm a YouTuber, I'm a musician and producer, and you can see me here at my sound recording studio. Uh, I'm also a sportsman and fitness trainer, powerlifter, bodybuilder, and all this shit. But I also love speaking English, while well, most of my videos are in Russian. You can find some in English in my channel, some with sub uh, subtitles, and some in the spoken language. But I really like to discuss some social and philosophical matters and let's jump into today's topic which is the difference between the prostitute, the porn actress and the slut. So why am I raising this topic? It's just because all three of these types uh, get some negative attitude in the society and I totally disagree with that. I don't think there's anything negative in what they do and I'll tell you why. First let's see what's common among all three. Prostitute, porn actress and the slut, they all sleep with different men. Sometimes they even sleep with different men at, at a time. Sometimes not only with men, but also with the women. And sometimes probably not only with homo sapiens. Well, they all have sex with different creatures at uh, different times. So, they may be doing it with pleasure or fun, or they may be obliged to do that. That's the difference. So, let's start with the easiest type, which is porn actress. That's a girl or a woman or a grandma, who knows? Who likes sex, who has sex, uh, many times by order of a producer or a director by their instructions and she earns money with that so what's wrong with earning money with what you can i see no difference and she likes it she probably takes a lot of pleasure in it in exposing herself that's a dominance instinct so that's okay too so i don't see anything negative in that and that's so easy she likes what she does she takes pleasure, she gives pleasure, she gets money, so what's wrong? It's the 21st century and YouTube is full of these porn actresses who's been bloggers and YouTubers and you can watch them. You can uh, find them, um, listen to them, how they got into porn business and just find out that they're really, really nice guys and girls. They're funny, they're quite smart. And they're good actresses, not only porn actresses, but actresses in general. So, to be a successful porn actress, you gotta be an actress first. Well, the next category is probably the oldest, and it's the prostitute. So, that's the girl that gets money just for the sex. Not an art form, as with the porn actress, but do you really personally know any porn actress? Do you? Or do you know a prostitute personally? Did you speak to them? Did you talk to them? Do you know the story? I personally don't know any. So I don't know these stories. There must be some hard circumstances that led them to that, but probably not. Probably that was their deliberate decision. But anyway, uh, it's also okay to earn money with your body. Who the hell does not do that? Don't you think that a professional boxer earns his money with his fists and a professional runner earns his money with his legs and fashion models and bodybuilders, they earn money with their whole bodies and even engineers, they earn money with their brain. Don't you think that a brain is a part of a body? Do you? Or you think there is a some infinite out-of-body soul of an engineer which comes and makes all this beautiful engineering. I really don't think so. Try to grab the head of an engineer and smash it over the wall and splashing the brains all over and let's see if this engineer is gonna stand up and create some, some beautiful engineering here or his beautiful soul coming to engineer something. I don't think that's the case. So, the prostitute earns money with her body, with her pussy and boobies, and that's perfectly fine. That's her choice. And the last but not least is the slut. 
What's the side of things of these slots? Who are these? What's the definition? I guess the slot is the girl who also, as a prostitute or a porn actress, she sleeps with different men, but she does that without money, deliberately. No money, probably a lot of pleasure. I don't think that's without a pleasure. I think they take pleasure, they give pleasure. So what's wrong with that? If a girl likes sex really, really much. She fucks there, she fucks here. All the men are satisfied and she feels fine. She likes it. She doesn't take any money as a prostitute. So guys uh, stay really satisfied with her job. So what's wrong with it? I don't even use the word slut anyway. I don't use it in Russian. I do not prefer it in English. I just call them girls that love sex. So here are my thoughts on these three types of women with low social responsibilities. So please write in comments what do you think of the sluts, prostitutes and porn actresses as persons, as profession, as a social attitude to them. I really would like to know what you think about it. Suggest more topics to discuss and if you like the stuff, please subscribe to my channel, put thumb up and see you in the next video. Low social responsibility.